Away, Natalie's mother, of course, calling today the end of a nightmare. The heartbroken Holloway family waiting 18 years to hear this information and find out what happened to their daughter, who would have turned 37 years old this Saturday. Tristan Rupert was in the courtroom as the family read their impact statement. Tristan Beth Holloway spoke to reporters right after the court today. What can you tell us? That's right, Sarah. Today, a day that the family has been waiting for for 18 long years. The opportunity to address their daughter's admitted killer in court, as well as hear his prison sentence get read aloud. Now, during her victim impact statement, Beth repeatedly turned and addressed Urine Vandersloot, glaring at him, even calling him a killer. At one point, she asked the judge to give Vandersloot the maximum sentence before turning back and telling Vandersloot that he, quote, looks like hell. While she fought through her emotions a handful of times during that victim impact statement, after the guilty plea was accepted and his sentence was read, the entire family was calm when addressing the media outside. Beth saying today the family goes from victims to victors as they have finally achieved justice for Natalie. Thanks to a lot of very smart and dedicated people here, I got the answer I've been searching for for the past 18 years. Yaron Vandersloot's confession means we have finally reached the end of our never-ending nightmare. And for me, reaching the end of the nightmare, being over is better than closure. Beth stresses this is not a goodbye to Natalie. Her and her family still carry her with her every single day. They think of her, and today, that's, of course, a very good feeling. Reporting in Birmingham, Tristan Rupert, WBRC, Fox 6 News, on your side. And we